Hi, if you're an artist and you struggle with um, the thing of too many ideas, like they're just coming and they're so exciting, oh my God. But then there's that crash of like no motivation, this flow between really intense creative outpouring, uh, but it sometimes doesn't even make it to creation because you get stuck mired. This is really common um, and it has to do with balance. It has to do with um, having a balance of structure and um, freedom, right? So that you, you have the freedom to let your ideas churn and, and go and get big, but you also have the structure to do the follow through. Because if you don't do that, what happens is that you get stuck in this feeling of like, oh, nothing ever comes of it. And I, and you start to um, feel bad <laughs> about yourself. The, the internal critic gets really intense on those of us who have tons of ideas, but little follow through. So one of the things that I help people with on a regular basis is um, creating a structure in your life that supports the follow through, that supports you in actually getting the stuff done. And there's a few parts of it. There's many more parts of it than I'm going to go into right now. But one is um, connection to other people who are also creatives. Um, that can be socially, but it can also be in something like a um, co-working session like I run on Tuesdays and Thursdays where you're you're getting together in some way to actually hold each other accountable to work. Having a buddy system, having somebody else involved, that's a big thing. Another thing is that as creatives, we often need this sense of change. We need um, things to not be static. Uh, you know, there's nothing, nothing worse for a creative than sitting in the same routine every day, day in and day out. So novelty is important, but so much novelty can throw you off. Again, it's balance. How much structure, how much freedom. So humans, um, structure of time and space. And the third thing I wanted to talk about was uh, a balance of exercise and and um, movement. You need the sense of movement in your body in order to be able to relax into a flow. All right, there is something about self-regulation, energetic regulation that comes with actually having the exertion of exercise on a regular basis. So those are only three things. There's many more. I hope it's helpful and I would love to hear from you. Um, questions, comments, and uh, certainly if you'd like to connect, I am I have uh, space right now for one more person, I think. All right, I'll talk to you soon.